four-year-old friends and family, I wanted to come to you today with some quick things that you can do. Hopefully you have all of this stuff at home um, to work on just overall hand strengthening and fine motor strength. So the first one is a spray bottle. Um, you can have any kind of spray bottle. Uh, I like this one. I got it in the dollar bin at Target. It's real small from front to back, so it's easier for the little kids to get their hands around, but any spray bottle you have will work. Great hand strengthening. They can water your plants, spray the driveway, play with it in the bathtub, any way you wanna let them play with it. This is a mustard or ketchup bottle that I got at the Dollar Tree. Um, filled it up with water. Um, really good, so on the spray bottle and for this, you're gonna wanna let them use their dominant hand. So if your child has established, if they're right-handed or left-handed, you want them trying to squeeze this with just that hand to build strength in that hand for cutting, handwriting, all those sorts of skills down the line. Um, another one, I have some kitchen tongs here. Um, and at this stage, I would really like to see them holding it with their thumb on one side and their other two fingers on the other side, just like they might hold a marker and have them start to pick things up. This is a cotton ball and put it in a container. It doesn't matter um, what they're picking up or where they're putting it, just the purpose, purposefully picking something up and putting it in. Great hand strength. Um, you can do it with smaller tweezers if you have them, um, but that's a way to start. This is a turkey baster. Um, squeezing water into it with their dominant hand and then squeezing it again the bathtub if you have a water table a baby pool whatever you have at home clothespins are a great way to work on hand strength at this stage we want to start building that strength more toward their index and middle finger with their thumb because um, that's how you're gonna hold something to write and you can have them just clip these on any surface so you can clip them on, I'm clipping them on to the side of this pan. You can have them clip them onto a piece of paper, whatever works. And then the last thing, I have squirted just a little paint on this paper plate and taken the clothespin. I have a cotton ball here and I'm gonna put the cotton ball, well, in the end of the clothespin. And then again, encouraging this grasp um, and have them paint using just that side of their hand. Good hand strengthening overall, um, just improving their grip, improving their grasp um, for those down the line handwriting skills. Um, I hope this helps and I hope to see you soon.